The deadly Paris attacks were planned for years with orders coming directly from al-Qaeda in the Arabian Peninsula. So claim the terror group today. The 12-minute video, which U.S. officials believe to be authentic, features pictures of gunman Sharif and Saeed Kawashi, with the group's commander praising the attack and calling it revenge for cartoons satirizing the Prophet Muhammad. We clarified to the Islamic world that the one who chose the target, laid the plan, financed the operation, and appointed its emir, Sheikh Nasser said, is the leadership of the organization. But he provided no proof. One of the plot's masterminds, he claimed, was American Anwar al awlaki killed in a U.S. drone strike in 2011. Despite the video claim, U.S. officials tell CNN it is not yet clear if AQAP executed direct command and control over the operation or if it provided some training and funding with the attackers selecting time, place, and target. Still, the investigation has already exposed a complicated and expanding jihadi network. The man seen accompanying Hayat Bamadian at a Turkish airport is tied to a Pakistani Afghan terror cell. Her companion, the kosher shop attacker Amadi Kulabali, pledged allegiance to ISIS in Iraq and Syria and is known to have communicated with the Kawashi brothers. Those brothers are now believed to have multiple ties to AQAP in Yemen. Tonight, a disturbing new look inside the assault on the kosher market. CCTV capturing the hostage taker Kulabali in body armor, forcing hostages to take down the CCTV cameras. Other hostages huddling together soon after the first hostages were killed. A baby stroller, possibly belonging to a child who survived the attack, hidden in a basement refrigerator, is left abandoned in the aisles.